It took a few years. Yeah, it took it took a little longer than we anticipated for various reasons. It's a big construction project. There was a big announcement today from internet giant Google. They're wrapping up their high-speed fiber construction project in Salt Lake City. Well, it comes as the state is pushing more high-speed internet across access in rural parts of the state who don't necessarily have internet access to their homes. But as Ben Winslow reports, it's easier said than done. Google Fiber is wrapping up its high-speed internet project in Salt Lake City. They've been building it since 2015. We'll fill in some neighborhoods that we haven't quite gotten to yet, but the bulk of Salt Lake City is done, and we're really, really excited to say that. At the same time, the internet giant announced it will start expanding into more cities across the Wasatch Front. But right now, Google says it has no plans to expand into an area political leaders have been pushing for some time, rural Utah. It's a very fair question. The rural issue is a tricky issue to solve. It's the right thing for policymakers to be talking about and asking questions about, and it's the right thing for internet service providers to be exploring how we can improve internet access in rural areas. It's not an easy fix. It's not even the future, it's the now. And we need that readily available. Hilldale Mayor Donia Jessup says her community spent some COVID-19 relief money to beef up their internet services. We have huge companies moving in, production companies, mortgage companies moving into Hilldale. The number one thing, do we have fiber available? The mayor says businesses have access to high-speed internet infrastructure, but not all residents do. She says getting fiber installed hasn't been easy. Your community is unique. I'm like, oh. I know, I've heard that a time or six. The mayor says any new development will have it built in, just like other utilities. So what I would like to see is enough ISPs to make the price low enough because of the competitive nature that bring, you know, that more companies bring. The Utah State Legislature says broadband internet is an infrastructure priority, especially after the pandemic. A bill to create a state office to expand internet offerings to underserved communities passed the House with bipartisan support, but it failed in the Senate this year. I actually spoke to a senator after that and asked what had happened, why he voted no, and his answer was very simple. He didn't like that it had the word equity in it. That was it. Um, and that, that was that was incredibly frustrating. Um, and it really just I think it just got caught up in politics and partisanship. Representative Jennifer Daly Provo isn't sure if she'll bring back the bill, but says the state still needs to address communities being left behind. And this needs to be something that we need to lay the groundwork for and needs to be a top priority always. On the Hill, Ben Winslow, Fox 13 News, Utah.